I'm going to show you how to make a basic watermark. It's pretty simple. What you want to do, media generators, pick a text. I like banner for my watermarks, just like the way that it's deformed. But you can pick any and change them the way you want for later. You can place that in there. Here you want to add your watermark text. That's what I'm going to put mine. I'm going to center it too just to make it. You can change the fonts. Let's see. Cosmic Sands. And then we will get into the properties of that later. Now, you want to add your video. Drag it down to another line. Take your watermark. Make it equal with your video. Find somewhere in your video. Preferably somewhere that you can see it. There we go. That's perfect. Now, you want to click the generated media button right here, which is the properties. And this is where we start editing it. This, for um, text color, just click this button here. And it changes to grayscale. Bring the L all the way down. Change it right just black. And then the transparency. It just put it to a nice nice transparency. You know, enough to where you can see through it and still see everything that's going on behind it. But you can still tell that it's there. Background color, you don't worry about that one. Go to effects. Your outline, you gotta have an outline. I like my feather and my width. All the way up but once again this is up to you you can choose to whatever you want change it back to grayscale linear click off see you can still see it around there a little bit you can tweak around with it drop the opacity of it I want to drop the opacity too much though see so, yeah, I don't know just just leaving the opacity there you keep that nice outline I'm going to draw a shadow same thing make it black and just make your shadow a little opaque but you know more than the original text so you can still see that it's there Alright, now that we got that done, we need to crop it. The event pan and crop. So in here, zoom out all the way. That's the wheel down. Then by making your camera bigger, which makes your image smaller, go ahead and find the size that feels right. That looks okay. And drag it onto the corner wherever you want your watermark to be. Get it situated all nice and neat. And you're done. And jump to another part in the video just to see there we go go ahead and you can change the fonts whatever you want of it make it your own all right I hope this helps some of you guys and uh see you later